Nurse? Look, I'm really worried about Mum. I don't know when the doctor came to see her. Care homes experience regular staff shortages. I'm so glad I've got this debrief session with you now. What's been happening, Yolanda? I don't know, it's just not what I expected. The patients that I want to take the medicine, family members keep harassing me. And I don't know, I, just, I can't keep up with all the doctor's calls and the buzzers and... It's a lot happening. Can you help me? <laughs> I just find it really hard to dedicate to the mm. carers. You're finding that difficult? I don't know, I think a lot of them are older than me and more experienced and I don't feel like it's my play. Oh, hi Alex, how's it going? Fine. Actually, not that great. What's up? <sighs> I just came out of a very frustrating project marathon meeting. What happened? Some people are just so stupid. And don't, just don't know what they're doing. But I thought project marathon was going really well. It is, it's just Adele. She could be so dumb sometimes. Why don't you tell me what you really think, would you? So I'm going over the project plan for next year and she just starts asking all these stupid questions. Like what? <laughs> like what the communication plan to the business is gonna be. That doesn't sound like a stupid question. What did you say? Well, I told her that a communication plan is hardly our biggest priority right now. I mean, wouldn't we just get internal comms to draft something at the time? Probably. Why didn't you just say that instead of causing an argument about the communications plan? Whose side are you on? It's not about choosing sides, Alex. I'm just trying to help. Well, I didn't ask for your help. Okay. And you know the really annoying thing is that just last week I sent her financial data to try and help her. That is the last time I'm doing anything like that again. I'll leave you to it. Good morning, Chris. Hi, Nicole. What time did you end up leaving last night? Oh, not long after you. I just had a few things to tidy up because I want to focus on the board report today, which is due next week. And it's my daughter's parent-teacher night tonight, so I want to leave a little earlier. Yeah, you don't want to miss that. Nicole? Yes, Chris? Um, I heard you talking the other day that people were sending you a summary of the forecast for their part of the business for this year. Yeah, that's right. But I better get a hold of that and then uh, I can pull that into an overall forecast for the balance of the year. Actually, I'm just working on it now. If you want to wait about an hour, I can send you the overall summary. Is there anything I can do to help? No, thanks. It, it would take me longer to explain what needs to be done. Well, if there's anything, let me know. Are you sure you can't get it done by the end of today? Maybe if the board report was the only thing I had to do. Can't they have the stuff wait until tomorrow? No, I told a whole bunch of people that I was going to get back to them today. Any questions at all? Actually, yes, I do. So if we go on to the project, would our targets be adjusted accordingly? Or would we be expected to take the 20% on top of what we already do? No, no, I wouldn't expect that.